Well, we're here at the Gladstone Entertainment Convention Centre and it's time to announce the funds raised from the 2023 Santos GLNG Mayor's Charity Ball. Of course, the funds go to three amazing local beneficiaries. We've got the Turtle Rehabilitation Centre on Coin Island. We've got the Gladstone Animal Rescue Group and of course the amazing team at Zonta Club Gladstone. So far, the Mayor's Charity Ball has raised almost $500,000 over the past 14 years. And this year, I'm hoping we can break that $100,000 mark again. But look, the money goes, as I said, three local beneficiaries. They do amazing work in a local community. So it's time, Flick, pass us a check and let's see how we went. Well, you get to see it first before these guys behind me. Oh. Wow. Whoa. Woo. 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 Wonderful. <laughs> 123,000 and a bit of extra money as well. That's fantastic. There we go, just over 40 grand. <laughs> That's what we've got. When it comes to money, I'm always on the board. $123,517.42. Very, very important. That's over $40,000 to our local beneficiaries. That's unreal. Thank you to everyone who got involved in the Santos GLNG Mayor's Charity Ball for 2023. Our amazing sponsors, of course, Santos, our committee, our MC, our um, auctioneer, and of course, the amazing entertainment we had on the night and the team here at the Gladstone Entertainment Convention Centre and all our volunteers. Well done team, that's fantastic. Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> well done. Super excited and very grateful. Mm. It's a wonderful feeling knowing that we have more money to do more good. Zonta is a women's organisation, so we're about supporting and empowering women and girls. So for us, it has given us that opportunity to be able to do so much more in the community with these women who really need the help that, they did, that we can give. That feels utterly wonderful, because at the moment, that covers about two and a half months of our vet bills. Just thank you, thank you, thank you.